G-Day, I'm Kenny Koala. Welcome to Assume News. Today we'll be talking about... Wait, what day is it? Ah, never mind. We'll get to that later. First off, let's start with... Oh, sorry about that. I've been up all night, mate. Crikey, mate. Imagine having a $180,000 income and only being left with $75 at the ripe young age of 27. It's like being a koala with a full belly, then suddenly finding yourself without a gum tree in sight. Now, I'm no math genius, but that just doesn't add up. But hey, life's full of surprises, isn't it? Maybe this young fella has a knack for spending money faster than a kangaroo can hop. Or maybe he's just really generous and showered his mates with gifts. Either way, it's a gentle reminder that money doesn't always guarantee happiness. Ah, yes. It seems we have another installment of the never-ending saga between Charles and Harry. According to recent headlines, Charles has taken issue with his son's behavior, deeming it rude, childish, and bashful. Now, I'm no expert. But I think it's safe to say that Harry's been taking a few notes from his old man's book. After all, who could forget Charles's infamous Tampengate scandal? But hey, at least Harry's not boring, right? Pass me the bottle of eucalyptus leaves, will you, mate? This is going to be a wild ride. Oh, mate. It seems a disgusting photo has provoked a senator's fury. Can you believe it? It's like a boomerang that just won't stop coming back. This photo must be something truly extraordinary to unleash such a reaction. But hey, we've all got our breaking points, don't we? Life can be full of surprises and sometimes they're not the good kind. So let's hope this senator can channel that outrage into something productive, like protecting our native wildlife or addressing more pressing issues. After all, there's a lot happening in this wide and wonderful country of ours, and we could all use a little positivity. Ah, mate, it seems we've had a few more uninvited guests arriving by bow. Crikey! Just when you thought the waters were quiet, here they come, sailing in like a bunch of adventurous seagulls. Now, I can't say I condone the illegal nature of their arrival, but you've got to hand it to them for their audacity. It's like a real-life game of hide-and-seek on the high seas. But don't you worry, Australia's Border Patrol is as vigilant as an eagle-eyed kookaburra. They've detected these sneaky arrivals faster than you can say, mate. Let's hope they're offered a fair go, just like any other Aussie battler. Oh, mate, it seems we've got a little known Kmart barcode hack that's got shoppers in a frenzy. Can you believe it? It's like discovering a secret stash of eucalyptus leaves that nobody else knows about. Apparently, there's a sneaky trick that can save you a pretty penny at the checkout. But hey, who am I to judge? If someone's figured out a way to outsmart the system, more power to him. It's like finding a shady spot on a scorching hot day. So, if you're feeling adventurous, give a go and let us know how it pans out. Major Sydney Station, huh? It appears that the hustle and bustle of the city got a little too exciting for our friends over at the station. Word on the gum tree is that a threat had them scrambling for safety. Well, 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 looks like someone wanted a bit of thrill in their day. Can't blame them, really. Life can be a bit too predictable at times, can't it? But fear not, fellow koala enthusiasts, because the authorities swiftly swooped in like a flock of galas to ensure everyone's safety. It's reassuring to know that even in the face of uncertainty, our mates down under are always ready to lend a paw. Ah, offended Aussie wedding pictures, eh? It appears that our mates down under have their knickers in a twist over some wedding photos. Now, I don't claim to be the fashion police, but apparently, these pictures have rubbed a few folks the wrong way. But let's be honest, when has everyone ever agreed on what's tasteful? It's like trying to get a mob of kangaroos to hop in the same direction. Nevertheless, it's important to remember that beauty is in the eye of the beholder, right? Just like how I find gum leaves to be a delectable snack. Oh, a radical solution to the Australian housing crisis, eh? Well, 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 
Looks like someone's got their thinking cap on. It's no secret that finding affordable housing down under can be tougher than finding a needle in a haystack. But fear not, my friends, because it seems like there might be a glimmer of hope on the horizon. Rumor has it that someone's come up with an out-of-the-box idea that could shake things up. I won't spoil the surprise, but let's just say it involves kangaroos and koalas working together to build treehouse communities. It may sound a bit bonkers, but hey, stranger things have happened in this great land of ours. Stressful, huh? Seems like there's been quite the commotion with all staff getting the boot via email. Well, ain't that a classic move? It's like trying to eat gum leaves with a fork. Just doesn't make sense. But hey, life's full of surprises, and sometimes those surprises come in the form of a digital pink slip. These things happen. I suppose. So, if you find yourself in a similar situation, don't fret too much. Take a deep breath, hop up a tree, and remember that there's always a fresh start waiting just around the corner. Who knows? Maybe this unexpected turn of events will lead to bigger and better things. Ah, the TV final's wrong choice, eh? It's like when you're craving a nice juicy eucalyptus leaf, but you end up with a mouthful of twigs instead. Not the best way to satisfy your cravings, that's for sure. But hey, these things happen in the wild world of television. Sometimes the judges and viewers don't see eye to eye, and it leads to a not-so-perfect ending. But fear not, my friends, because there's a silver lining in every cloud. Perhaps this wrong choice will pave the way for new opportunities and undiscovered talents. Life's like a boomerang, you know? Ah, think twice about going to these destinations, huh? Well, who needs all that excitement and adventure anyway? There are plenty of other spots to explore, like lounging in a cozy gum tree or taking a leisurely stroll through the bush. Besides, who needs fancy hotels and crowded tourist traps when you can have a peaceful picnic with a mob of kangaroos? But, you know, to each their own. If you're into challenging hikes, stunning landscapes, and unforgettable experiences, then maybe these destinations are worth a second thought. Just remember to pack your sense of curiosity and a healthy dose of common sense. Ah, this wild mad street machine, eh? It's the talk of the town, apparently. People are falling over themselves to catch a glimpse of this beast on wheels. I mean, who wouldn't want to witness a roaring spectacle tearing up the pavement? It's like watching a kangaroo bounce through the bush, but with an engine and a whole lot of noise. Now, whether it demands respect or not, well, that's up for debate. But one thing's for sure, it's definitely demanding attention. Just be sure to keep your distance, folks. You don't want to get caught in the wake of this wild ride. And now, it's time for the weather forecast with our lovely Wendy Windy. Now you look like a breath of fresh air today, Wendy. Konnichiwa, Nepal no tenki yoho desu. Katomanzu kara wa hare tokidoki bare, kiyon wa 24 do desu. Po kara wa kumori zora ga ooku, saikou kiyon wa 31 do desu. ラリトプルに移動すると晴れ時々晴れ気温は摂氏26度です。ビラート流れは晴れていて気温は摂氏33度で暑いです。バラトプルは曇り空で気温は32度です。最後にジャナクプールは曇りで気温は33度です。今日